This is Chef Chris with Market Street. Today I'm going to show you how to make a simple strawberry basil sorbet. Yes, yeah, I said basil. It adds a nice flavor to the strawberries. What we've done is slice some up. This is approximately two pounds. I'm going to take our berries and put them in a food processor and puree these up. So what I like to do is strain all the seeds and all the thick pulp out of the strawberries to give us a nice smooth texture to our sorbet. So I'm using a fine sieve strainer here. Pour it in and just stir it. And all of our liquid goes through. And as you can see, it reduced down to quite a bit. So we just have a nice, silky, smooth puree here. To this, I'm gonna add sugar, some water, and some fresh squeezed lemon. And I'm gonna mix that all together. And you see we have some fresh basil we're gonna add. Beautiful leaves, great time of year for basil. I'm not gonna add this yet. I'm gonna add it towards the end. That way it doesn't darken and we still have that nice fresh flavor of basil. Okay, now that we have that mixed, let's talk about the ice cream machine. This is an inexpensive ice cream machine uh, that you can get at any department store. It runs around $50. And it just includes a bowl that uh, has a gel in it that freezes. Uh, I put this in the freezer overnight and it's ready to go. Turn the machine on. It's going to start to turn and we slowly pour the mixture into the ice cream maker. We're going to let it go about 20 30 minutes and we'll have sorbet. After the sorbet was finished in our ice cream maker, I put it in the freezer overnight to firm it up a little bit. We get this nice, beautiful color. And there we have our strawberry basil sorbet. Coming up next, I'm gonna be making a strawberry panna cotta. 